Today we will assist you, how to uninstall Windows Media Player, from your copy of Windows. We have used a Windows 11 power device for this guide. You can follow this tutorial for Windows 10, Windows 8, Windows 8.1 and Windows 7. There are many famous, and most used video and audio formats, that are not supported by Windows Media Player. This is why the majority of Windows users, switch to third-party media players. We have seen many non-technical Windows users, who have no idea, how things work in Windows, to play a video, or audio file after installing a third-party media player. They drag the video file, to the newly installed media player, rather than opening it via the Open With menu. Since Windows Media Player is set, as the default media player, whenever you double-click on a video file, Windows Media Player opens up, with an error message saying, this file is not supported. If you want to get rid of Windows Media Player, just because it irritates you, and you have to drag, and drop a video over any third-party media player to play it, we suggest not uninstalling Windows Media Player, and using Windows Open with Menu, to set a third-party media player, as the default media player. Right-click on a video, or audio file, and hover your mouse cursor over the Open with option, and if your preferred media player is listed in the list, choose the media player, you want to open desired video, or audio file with. If not listed, click choose another app option. If your desired media player, is not available in the next list, click on look for another app on this PC option, to locate the media player of your choice. Checkmark always use this app, to open to permanently set it as default, the next time Windows Media Player will not open up. With the latest and previous versions of Windows Media Player, that are still widely used, you can disable it, it is possible to disable Windows Media Player on Windows 7, Windows 8, Windows 10, and Windows 11. The benefit of disabling Windows Media Player is the T next time you change your mind, you can enable native media player, within seconds without reinstalling it. To disable Windows Media Player, go to the Start menu, and open the Control Panel. If your Control Panel view is set to Category, switch it to Large, or Small icons. Now find and open the Programs and Features Utility. On the right side, there will be an option named, Turn Windows Features On or Off, open this option for the next step. Look for Media Features, and expand it, and uncheck Media Features, and Windows Media Player. Click to save the settings and exit, you'd need to restart your device. You can enable Windows Media Player, by following the instructions, whenever you need it. It is possible on Windows 10, and Windows 11 to completely uninstall Windows Media Player, to uninstall Windows Media Player on Windows 10, or Windows 11, press Windows and I keys, together to launch the settings app. Open apps, from the left hand side pane. Now go to optional features, find Windows Media Player, if the list is long. You may use the search bar, please keep in mind, Windows Media Player will not show up here, if you have disabled it. Click on Windows Media Player, then click Uninstall to completely remove it. Windows Media Player removal is complete, it will not come your way. You can reinstall Windows Media Player, from optional features. Click Add an optional feature, to reinstall Windows Media Player. Hopefully, this tutorial has been useful, and informative to you, we hope you have managed to disable, or uninstall Windows Media Player, by following today's guide. You may contact us via the comments section, if we skipped covering any crucial points. Team Soft Suggester will try its best to help you.
Leave your questions, feedback, and suggestions in the comment box. More info and download links can be found on softsuggester.com. Subscribe to Software Geek for more useful videos, and ring bell button for the latest updates.